Hello friends, welcome to my channel Data Tech. In this channel, I generally create a technology videos. Okay, please subscribe to my channel to get more technology videos. And thank you for people who already subscribed. So in this video, I am going to explain you about how to access uh, uh, Twitter API using the Python. Okay, so in the Python, you have a uh, you have a uh, package called TwipPy. Okay, TwipPy. So using that Python package, we are going to access the uh, Twitter API and uh, access the uh, tweet messages from different uh, people. Okay. So first thing what you need to do is you need to have a uh, you need to have a uh, uh, you need to create a developer account in the Twitter. Okay. So that you will get the access key and uh, tokens uh, to access the APIs. Okay. To create a developer account, you should have a Twitter account. It's a basic Twitter Twitter account. Okay, so I'm going to explain you the step by step process. Please uh, follow the entire video to uh, get more knowledge on it. Okay, so first you log on to the uh, twitter.com. Okay, once you log on to the twitter.com, uh, click on the sign up button. Okay, give your name. Okay, and when you give your name, so you need to provide uh, uh, either email ID or phone number to create your account. So I just want to use the email ID. So I just I will click on use uh, email instead. So then I need to provide my email ID. So once I provide my email ID, uh, then click on next to continue. So then it will show you this personalized uh, some customization option. If you want, you can just uh, uh, let it be or if you want to uh, ignore this thing, you just uncheck it and they say next. So then uh, you need to click on this sign up. Okay. So once you click on the sign up, it will ask you for uh, uh, verification code. There will be a verification code sent to your email ID. Okay, the email ID which you mentioned the previous step. Uh, so <clears throat> go and check your email ID and take the verification code and uh, like this. So you will get a message like this and enter the verification in this uh, screen. So then click on next. So it will ask you uh, a screen uh, where it will have to specify your password for your uh, Twitter account. So you see the password. <clears throat> then you can actually provide the profile picture for the Twitter. Okay, so Twitter account, uh, either you can give it uh, by clicking on the upload button, upload uh, uh, a section or you can skip for now. So uh, then you can brief about yourself also uh, as your uh, your bio uh, section or you can ignore by skipping uh, skip for now. Then uh, it will ask, it will suggest you to upload your contacts uh, uh, from Gmail uh, ID which you given, but you can ignore it or uh, if you want you can upload the contacts. So once you click on uh, 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 not now or upload context. I just uh, clicked on uh, not now, so it will come to the uh, next screen where it will actually uh, what are the things uh, which are the topics you are interested. So basically, sports or music and entertainment, technology, the various section it will be available. You can choose uh, whatever uh, section you are interested, or you can click on the skip for now, and then it will uh, suggest you some of the. Uh, Twitter account to, to follow like uh, uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi and then uh, <coughs> White House Twitter account. So there are few Twitter account uh, uh, based on your region or something it will actually suggest you. So you just uh, you can say uh, follow or you can just click on next. So then it will uh, give you a screen where you want to turn off the notification. So you can just follow notification or if you don't want just skip for now. And then you then account will be created and it will show you with the welcome screen. So then click on the get started and the which theme you want to have it. So you can just choose whatever the theme background theme you want it. So I'll just go with the default one. Okay, so you can try out other option also. So and once you click on this, then it will you will you will see this uh, <coughs> home page of the Twitter uh, uh, your account page. Okay, so you see in uh, left navigation there are recently they changed a uh, few style of uh, Twitter uh, account. So home uh, uh, tweet and uh, um, uh, account details, other stuff. Okay. So notification, other stuff. Uh, so once you have this, so you need to, uh, we need to actually now we created the basic uh, Twitter account. Now we need to go and create the developer account so that we will get the access key for uh, us to uh, 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 create a uh, uh, application. Basically you need to create an application, then you can create access keys. Uh, then using that you can access the uh, Twitter API. So navigate to this URL like developer.twitter.com slash en slash apps. So by default there is no application is there. So click on create app. 
once you click on the create app it will just uh, tell you please apply for the twitter developer account just say apply then it will ask you for some uh, uh, reasons like what is the primary reason for using a developer uh, tools so probably you can say professional usage or hobby or academic purpose or you can actually mention uh, uh, student or whatever the, whatever the section what are the why you need that uh, uh, twitter uh, you want to, to analyze or you want to get the uh, you want to explore the api or you want to uh, get the tweet message and what you know to, what you are going to do so that thing uh, basically it is asking so i'll just go as a developer uh, student profile okay so then click on next and you need to provide this uh, uh, phone number to validate okay otherwise it will not allow you this uh, enable the nx button so you need to provide the phone number once you provide the phone number it will ask you a country to choose country code and then enter your mobile number then the verification will be sent to your uh, phone number uh, check your phone number phone message text message and uh, give the verification uh, message which you received on the phone to uh, this page and click on verify so it is you can see phone verification uh, your phone number is now verified okay then uh, click on the next so you just specify uh, what country you do, uh, live in so india and from uh, which uh, twitter account you are going to connect so my twitter account is data tv uh, india so from there i am going to connect so and provide uh, you need to specify uh, uh, <clears throat> like uh, what is the what is the plan to use this twitter data or apa so you just provide the information okay and uh, other there are other section also so if you are actually going to do other functionalities basically uh, basically you need to go into access the right so when you access the tweet messages you can also do the there are also apis so once retrieving the message uh, from the twitter okay api for getting the message or tweet messages and also you have apis to create retweet it and uh, do some kind of aggregation on it so th those things you can actually if you apply those things you need to provide the uh, uh, dis you have to provide the uh, what is it you have to describe yourself like why you are going to do so basically uh, that's what you have to uh, uh, specify the reason why you are actually doing uh, going to get those uh, uh, messages or uh, that uh, going to do what kind of activities you are going to do okay uh, then uh, I, I will say no for now all this i just want to get the message and uh, do some uh, um, uh, um, <coughs> analysis on that for that i don't need this uh, retweeting the message or doing the aggregator and stuff so i'll just say no for all these services and then click on next so it will come to review what are the information you given it will just show you for the review just once uh, the review is done you just uh, you verify that what are the information you have given is correct and click on uh, looks good then it will ask you to uh, um, specify this terms and condition or agreement or all this just click on this agree uh, by clicking the box you indicate that you read the agreement agreement of developer agreement all this so just click on the uh, checkbox and submit uh, application once you submit application it says uh, please uh, uh, <coughs> thank you for applying uh, for access to the twitter developer account please confirm your email so it will be sent there will be some notification sent your uh, uh, confirmation mail okay, just go and uh, confirm your uh, email id okay so i means uh, the your, your your confirmation for uh, applying this account uh, developer open your mail id and just say confirm your mail uh, then it will be say congratulations you have successfully created the new developer account with all this now you can again come back to this developer dot twitter dot com slash en slash apps page then you can click on again the create uh, uh, create an app so then uh, it, uh, it will suggest you to enter your app name and also describe your uh, uh, application description what you are going to do with this application okay then uh, click on this website url this is mandatory and then come to this page the last uh, tell us how this app is, will be used so something like that you just say i'm going to use for some kind of understanding the twitter <coughs> message information so just what are the information out of the description you can provide you can just provide the basic description and just click on create so once you click create it will actually review our uh, developer terms it will show you some information just say create uh, once you click on create so you will be uh, created with the app my app name is demo app dm uh, so <coughs> once this is created 
you can you can actually come to this uh, tab so you have application details tab uh, keys and uh, tokens tab and permission click on the next tab which is a keys and tokens so by default you will see consumer uh, api keys like you will have api key and uh, api secret key will be created by default and then you have to create a, a access token and a access token secret so you can click on create so those two also will be created so with four this this four information like api key api secret key then access token access token secret with the four information only you can make a request to the uh, twitter api okay and get the tweet messages and what you can do whatever there. so uh, that's it uh, 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 to create a uh, uh, twitter basic account basic account and also developer account and uh, generate this uh, keys and tokens once you are done with it, once you have done this you will have four uh, uh, um, the four information of keys and token with that we are going to make the uh, api call okay using the python uh, uh, package so now actually uh, i have created a program okay uh, to uh, with the four uh, uh, the information right uh, uh, api key api secret and uh, access token access token secret all four information i placed on the uh, json file okay so i am going to read the json file and get this information so uh, so you just what you need to do is first you need to install this uh, tweet by python package so to do that you can just say uh, sudo sudo pip install uh, tweet by okay this will install the package then you can write this program so basically i need to, you need to import a tweet by uh, tweet by, uh, package uh, as tw and uh, then i am going to uh, import the json also because i am going to read the json file which contains a twitter api credential okay so all this four information consumer key consumer secret access token access token uh, secret all this four information in the json file i just lo load that json file which i read the json file I load it the you will get a dictionary with the four information i access the four keys and store the values in my four variables okay so with this four information i can make the uh, connection to the uh, twitter account ap okay and uh, get the details so first what you are going to do i are going to do uh, <coughs> auth and learn. we are going to make the authentication authentication this enter those two information you will get the authentication and set the access tokens so we provide the access uh, token and the uh, access token secret once uh, this is done you will be uh, authenticated so then you can say tweet by dot ap of this authentication object okay so you have got the api now you can do uh, all this uh, <coughs> uh, searches based on the keywords okay so i'm going to search a uh, uh, word trump okay in my in the twitter okay and i'm going to get uh, 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 messages since uh, uh, first september okay i don't want to hold messages i want to get the recent uh, last uh, i'm actually recording this window uh, we're recording this video on uh, 4th september so from uh, from uh, first september uh, what are the like uh, <coughs> tweets came with uh, keyword trump okay name trump i want to get the tweet messages only i want to get only five for, for testing purpose, I just want to new, get the uh, five messages. Okay, so you can create a cursor object by specifying the search uh, by specifying the uh, <coughs> API search uh, method and what is the search word keyword <coughs> and also language is English and you specify the uh, the lower limit from since when you from from since when you want to get the tweet messages from this at first September. So once you do this, you get a collection of uh, tweet messages, okay, and then uh, you can iterate and uh, read the messages. So basically, this will be uh, iterable. So just uh, using the for uh, uh, method, iterate tweet in the tweets. So then in the tweet object, uh, it will be a, a big dictionary where I want to interested in uh, basically uh, only text message, uh, the message only a tweet message I want because. If I'm interested in other uh, other uh, fields, I can also get it. Just now, I want to show you uh, this demo with uh, how to uh, connect to the Twitter API and the, uh, give the uh, search uh, uh, keyword and uh, uh, the date limit, okay, as a lower limit, and get the few message and show you, okay, for the demo. So then I'm at appending into the 
uh, one uh, list for some uh, uh, for further analysis uh, i'll just display it here print okay so i'll run this so basically uh, so it has actually uh, got the messages like uh, uh, trump uh, slash uh, bar six slash presidential campaign on sixth best to comment on the proof of conspiracy some messages are the many uh, few messages people are put okay you know in the the fact that government has uh, sat on the these so called emergency funds all this somebody posted all these messages so like this uh, you can actually connect to the uh, twitter api using the python using python uh, <coughs> package called twipy you can get the information you can do the uh, sentiment analysis or you can do a lot of stuff okay so you can correlate with the uh, obviously you can get the uh, current uh, uh, world economy details and compare with the uh, other data you can do a lot of things uh, with the twitter analysis using the tweet messages you can do this a uh, lot of analysis so with that i will stop uh, in this video probably in the future video we will we'll actually do the sentiment analysis using the tweet messages uh, thank you so much uh, friends uh, please subscribe to my channel uh, data tech to get more technology videos thank you so much